Picture a bus. A big silver bus. Like a bus, the change in climate can speed up, slow down, overheat, or, if things go very wrong, crash. So, here's the bus headed downhill toward the edge of a cliff. That cliff, it's climate catastrophe. Decisions made today could, decades down the road, either avert an accident or drive the bus right over that cliff. Political leaders are behind the wheel. What are they to do? They could tap the brakes and safely round the bend. The brakes in this scenario are carbon pricing plans that try to slow emissions with either a tax or market-driven policy. CO2 prices around the world currently fall anywhere from $3 to $130 a ton, and the price is going up. The costs depend on how economists crunch the numbers, how energy users respond, and more importantly, how politicians write laws. The economists who estimate what a ton of emitted CO2 should cost are trying to solve the world's gnarliest math problem. They mash together projections of population, economic growth, energy use, and emissions. Then they have to extrapolate future costs of damages from warming. And then they have to translate those costs into today's dollars. Here's another complication. Slowing climate change with conventional carbon pricing may not take some important things into account. Risk, uncertainty, and how private markets value them. There are known risks like sea level rise and hotter heat waves, and there are unknown risks like, well, we don't know. A second option for the bus driver takes these unknowns into account. The effect is to slam on the brakes, slashing emissions without hurting the economy. But hitting the brakes hard means a higher carbon price, at least at first. Once people start using cleaner energy more efficiently, prices should start to fall. There is a third option, hit the accelerator. Scientists say climate change is dangerous, but that doesn't mean the bus driver needs to play it safe. There's something exhilarating about careening toward the edge at top speed. In that case, over a cliff may be where we're headed in a climate changed.